how do I unlock my phone without typing in a password? Well, and how do I keep my glasses from fogging up while wearing a mask? I can't help with the glasses, but I can help with the mask by using your Apple Watch. So, common dilemma, you have a mask and you're trying to unlock your phone, but how do you do that? Because you're wearing a mask. Well, Apple has <laughs> unmasked this problem by using your Apple Watch. An update just came out. Let's take a look at how you connect and use your Apple Watch to unlock your iPhone when you're wearing one of these. Here we go, ready? Shh. Probably just got a notification of the update. So go to settings. Then you wanna to go to general. Then you wanna to go to software update. Automatically updates. So I just updated mine to iOS 14.5. So now you wanna go down to face ID and passcode type in your passcode, and then scroll down to this feature right here, unlock with Apple Watch. Now if that's grayed out, read that small print, use the secure connection to your Apple Watch to unlock your iPhone, huh, your watch, your watch must be nearby. Well, my watch was nearby, but it was out of date. I'll show you how to check your version. So on your Apple Watch, click on the crown, Scroll over to settings. So again, click on the crown, open up settings, go to general, software update, and it should automatically start upgrading you to watch OS 7.4. Once the watch is updated, then you'll have this little thing enabled. So we'll come back to that in about two to 10 minutes as soon as this is done updating. So again, if this is grayed out, it's either because your watch isn't connected to your phone or you have not updated your Apple Watch to the newest 7.4 version. So this might take a while. I recommend that you charge your Apple Watch while you're doing the install. And let me read you the fine print with the little, you know, hockey puck. There we go. Let's see, ability to unlock your iPhone X and later with Apple Watch when you attempt to use Face ID while wearing a mask. Option to classify, Bluetooth device and setting to correct identification for headphones and notifications. Ability to stream audio and video content from Apple Fitness, nice. Support for the EKG app on Apple Watch Series 4 or later. Support for Heart Rhythm Notification in Australia and Vietnam. Well, those are some good fixes. But uh, the main thing people were, were waiting for was that ability to unlock. And again, you're going to need the iPhone X or later. So if we go back, software update, it looks like it's done. Now if we scroll down, install, and then it wants you to put it on its charger as well. To install the update, make sure your Apple Watch is on its charger. Connected Wi-Fi, installation will start. So you have to have your Apple Watch at least at 50%. And mine was at 90 something when I started this. So now it's verifying the install. And now we wait. So far this whole update has taken me about over 10 minutes. As far as just screen time, it was pretty easy. I just had to uh, unlock my phone with my face, because I have my mask off. Uh, in case you're wondering, this is the Apple Watch 6, 44 millimeter, 44 millimeter version. And I usually get questions about this, so I'll just answer it now. This is a Barton watch band. Oh, and there's the infamous update. Awesome. Okay, we got everything updated. Let's unlock this. We can go to settings. General, software update, check-in for update, your Apple Watch is up to date. So now we unlock this with my face. Again, we go to general, scroll on down to face ID and passcode. And now if we scroll down to Peter's Apple Watch, unlock with Apple Watch. 
Blip. Peter's Apple Watch will unlock iPhone when mask is detected. Face ID can't recognize you with a mask. Your iPhone will unlock with face ID. A haptic notification. Cool. Turn on. Well, that takes a bit. Yeah, it works. All right. Let's give this a try, shall we? All right, let's see how fast this is. You can see my mask in the reflection. So I turn on my phone. And then, so you can feel the haptic feedback and if you have your sound off, you hear the click. And it's really fast. Oh, that was fast. So awesome. Now, if you're out shopping and you have to wear your mask, you don't have to type in your passcode to unlock your phone. If you have an iPhone, that is. Oh, that's quick. Good job, Apple. And that's all I have for today. I hope the tutorial helped you. And if you have an Apple Watch, wearing a mask and unlocking your phone just got a lot easier when you're out in public. Uh, I've tried it several times since I did the update and it's worked great. Where they had to have Wi-Fi enabled. So again, if you're having trouble, just update your phone, update your watch, click those boxes that I showed you, and then you'll be able to use your watch to unlock your iPhone when you're wearing a mask. Thanks for watching and let the credits roll for the Paramount Kid. Goodbye.